Okay, welcome back to the channel. Today you join me in Suffolk. We're at Clare Castle Country Park. Um, parking here is on the Ringo app. It's about 360 for the day. Um, to be honest with you, I was expecting a little bit more out of the car park. It is a little bit not very country parky, car parky. But um, yeah, it is what it is. It's a car park. So um, yeah got plenty of information I did just try and go into the uh, visitor center to get a map uh, but it doesn't seem to be open um, there's several walks um, yeah so let's go and have a look around and see what it's all about Yeah, so when I woke up this morning and the sun was shining, so I thought let's get out and do a bit. And now it's gone real overcast. But um, yeah, we're here now. I've got some bits and pieces to cook up, cook, cook up. I've got a few bits and pieces to cook up for dinner. So um, yeah, let's go and have a look. Apparently this is the mot. Whatever the mot is. It's too windy up here. Let's get down from here and have a look around, see what else there is to offer. But I reckon on a nice hot day, this would be amazing up here. The views of the rolling countryside of Suffolk are pretty amazing. It's certainly a damn sight easier coming down than what it is going up. Oh, I got a puff on. So this actually follows the old railway track into Clare, which apparently closed in 1967. And um, apparently this you could walk quite a long way on this. Um, just been over a couple of bridges, uh, over a couple of little rivers, and uh, just spotted this, this old bridge here. So I thought we'd have a little walk up. I ain't going no further. <laughs> there are quite a few walks around here. Some of them are quite long. Um, like I said, I did pop into the visitor centre to pick up a map, um, but they're closed. So there are some different ones online. There's a few walking clubs use the site, and they've got their own little maps and different walks that they do. So uh, yeah, it's, it's, it can be quite confusing because there's quite a few like I say, different groups, that they've got different maps uploaded. But uh, yes, yeah, so we're going to just have a little mosey round today. And see what it's all about. But yeah, see old trains used to come underneath here. They'd have been steam trains as well. So, uh, yeah. Oh God. Oh, hello. There's definitely an echo. <laughs> uh, how cool is this? So maybe on a, on a nice day, when I know where I'm going. Because as you've seen in my previous videos, my sense of direction, that ain't that good. So uh, yeah, so maybe another day. But it's nice to be out. I got this place planned for um, two weeks time. Uh, but then when I looked, schools are actually on holiday for Easter. So yeah, filming, I like, it's going to be packed. 
especially if the weather's snowing, like we normally have at Easter. Um, yeah, so the, like I say, I thought I'd have a little look around here today. We might come back and do a big video and have a proper look around. But uh, yeah, like I say, it would be nice just to get out, have a look around. Because once again, I didn't even know this place was here. So uh, yeah, it's amazing. Once you start looking around, the different places that are available. Yeah, and the park does run alongside of the River Stour, which I'm not too sure if that's here or here because there's like two there's like a could be a drainage channel um yeah like i say i bet in the summer this place is absolutely heathen thank god it's not the summer oh this must be the river hold up And you may have noticed that a lot of my videos contain a lot of ducks. That's because I know what they are. <laughs> They're ducks. Mm. Decisions, decisions. Do I go through there? Or do I go up here? Maybe we'll have a look up here. Yeah, so a little update on the bus. Uh, she's nearly ready for the MOT. Uh, it's had all the uh, filters done, so let's get her the full service. And I've just fitted a new exhaust on it. Because I thought it was blowing a little. When I went to take off, it actually snapped in half. <coughs> so, uh, yeah, that definitely needed doing. So, yes, yeah, so hopefully, I've got it in a couple of weeks' time. So, hopefully, it won't be anything too, too bad than he's doing to it. But hey, only time will tell. Oh. <laughs> so I soon got back around to that. How did that happen? I hope there's a bit more. <laughs> Otherwise, I don't think the website kind of tells the truth. <laughs> but then I haven't said that. My navigational skills, as I've mentioned before in the past, are not the best. Oh no, that is right. Yeah, because that's where it was all, all flooded up there. So I decided to walk around and yeah, we do come back out. We do come back out here. Oh. Okay. Well, let's see, what's this other way? I ain't kicked much roots with me boots yet. Ooh, looks like it could be an early lunch. Now wrong in that. So I just found another little path. Next to the river. <laughs> Next to the river, can't get the van down here though. Oh, maybe I can. Um, yeah, we'll have a little mosey along here. And uh, see what occurs. I ain't seen any bears. No bears in the wood today, boy. Okay, so I found another couple of paths. Quite a wind's getting off. Um, but unfortunately, they will lead me back to here. So maybe there's something I'm missing. 
who knows? What I do know is that I'm going to get back in the van. I'm going to have a cup of coffee and decide what to do. I say, do I do, I do a cook up there? Um, in a, just It's just the car park. Or do I find somewhere with a bit more, bit of scenery to look at? I don't know. I just don't know. Probably during the summer. You know, there there are lots of walks to go on. Um, but yeah, they all lead you like out of the park. Um, they might lead you around the town, which yeah, okay, the, the the town is pretty, but it's not quite what I come for today. So um, yeah, so let's get back to the bus, and um, yeah, see where it takes us. Okay, so we travelled about 20 miles to this little spot here. Um, yeah, I found somewhere level. We're going to have a cook up. I haven't even had a cup of coffee yet. So my first job, have a cup of coffee, sort some gear out to cook, and uh, yeah, we'll get back to you. Just for the record, I don't know who DH is, and um, I have been here before, but on my own, honestly. Let's crack on. Right, so I've got my coffee. Ah, why do I always take a sip when I say I've got a coffee? No idea. Right, so today, for a cook-up, I've got some uh, minced pork. I've got some egg noodles. I did cheat. I should have done dried noodles, but I want to do one pot, which you can use one pot, because you do the noodles first, like I have done before. Uh, but I thought I'd cheat, so I've got some egg noodles. I've got some mange too, and other bits, because I couldn't just get mange too. I've got a carrot, I've got garlic, mm, garlic. Uh, I've got some, uh, I've got some cashews rather than rather than peanuts, and I've got some teriyaki sauce. So I'm going to have a chop up, and um, yeah, we'll get back to you in a minute. I'm looking forward to this, guys. Okay, see, so we've got me mange too chopped, ribbons, me ribboned my carrots, ribboned them, look, and um, got some chopped garlic, and I've roughly chopped some cashew nuts, just for a bit of dressing, a bit of finishing a finesse on top of the said article I'm about to create. Oh god, um, yeah, so I'm going to finish my coffee, catch up with you in a bit. I'm now getting really hungry. give to you teriyaki pork mint stir-fry with mange too, carrot noodles 
and nuts. Right, I'm going to have a go at this. I'll catch you in a bit. Okay guys, that was dinner done, and that was a good dinner. <laughs> Easy peasy, tastes really good, and I've got some left for me tea. Right, I think at this point, it has started to get a bit busy around here. We've got other people pulling up, getting out, walking their dogs, having to walk around. And this road is doing my head in. <laughs> every time I go to film, there's been nothing. And every time I go and film, as either a lorry or a car go past, I'm fed up with trying to do it now. So it is what it is. So I've got a little bit of tidying up to do. Ooh. I've got a little bit of tidying up to do in the bus and um, then I think I'm gonna have another cup of coffee and just chill here for a bit. And uh, yeah, so if you are new to the channel, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe and that like button. If you have been here before, same old thing hit that subscribe click that like leave us a comment i do like a good comment yeah guys so thanks for watching look out for the next video i don't know where it'll be i don't know what i'll be doing don't know when it'll be but um yeah keep your eyes open there'll be one very soon so thanks for watching and uh take it easy and we'll catch you again ta-da for now